Hi folks, welcome to the Excellent Universe channel. Please like, thumbs up and subscribe, comment to help other people get these wonderful ideas. Thank you very much. Welcome back if you've been here before. Uh, it's a beautiful sunny day. Hi there. Uh, hi. I have my mask. It's, as I said, it's uh, end of January 2022 and uh, still I have to wear masks sometimes. And, uh, but it's a beautiful sunny day. I'm out at the park and I don't know, maybe I need my mask sometimes, maybe. And um, this is just a little bit of a update on what's happening in the news and um, sort of a mystery for people who are interested in investing in electric cars. Oh, it is illegal to feed birds in this park. Okay, so don't be feeding birds at parks. I guess you get too many birds, something like that. It will mess up the regular balance of nature. That's what it will do. It's going to get certain kinds of birds and that like human food and then maybe cause trouble for the other birds. It just goes to show we have way too many people in certain areas and you could argue way too many people all together on the planet. So, um, but as I said, um, I'm going to give a little bit of news. So right now there's a mystery of what's happening with Russia and Ukraine and uh, people are very worried. So it could cause for you investors or if you're a stock trader, which you have to be very smart to do well. But if you are, <laughs> that's sort of a warning. If you're not, if you're not an A student with high grades and good with money, it's a warning to don't be a stock trader. Probably, it's more like gambling, which is dangerous with your money. But you can do it with a small, small percent of money that you don't need. So I don't completely discourage it. It's a good, good way to learn maybe that you're good or not good or just became lucky. <laughs> so as I said, so there's a big chance of a stock market crash sort of looming. We've had a recent, at least a correction. And so we could be on a way in a, what they would say is a bear market where stocks over time, I'm talking about the US stock markets like New York Stock Exchange and the NASDAQ. Um, over time, the stock values in those stock markets go down. Usually probably 20%, 30% or more would be a bear market. If it's maybe 10 to 20%, that might just be called a correction, which happens every couple of years. But right now, things are very extremely high priced. Um, and I say things, I mean the stocks in the stock market and the overall index, for example, like a Standard & Poor's 500. Um, the prices are very high because people didn't see other good investments recently. The interest rates, for example, that you could get from buying government bonds or treasuries or any, any kind of bonds, the interest rates weren't that high. They were even, people would call them negative because if a treasury bond or treasury bill, short term, which is a short term bill, it might pay, you know, between one and 3% or less, uh, something like that. But with inflation being maybe two to 6% or even more, that means, uh, say you invest $100, but you get 3%, which is actually maybe a high return right now. So after a year, you have $103, but prices have gone up. So something that cost $100 at the beginning of the year, maybe costs $106 or $115. And so, and you have 103 from the 100 that you started with. So it's, that's what, what's called 
like a negative uh, negative earnings uh, so <laughs> it's the same thing as a loss it's I guess negative earnings is a euphemism what are your earnings well they're they are actually a loss they're not positive they're negative so uh, this is just informational and I'm not a financial advisor I just want to provide you with some news and as I said uh, there's a big question with Russia and Ukraine Russia looks like it might take over an independent place called Ukraine by force with troops and they might fake a reason there might be some trickery involved and um, so it could be a way that actually a war starts and so people are very worried if there's a chance of war there's a big chance the stock market will crash it's it's a disaster and uh, it could be you know people deciding that they wanted the american stock market to crash so they're threatening a war merely for economic reasons and maybe <laughs> possibly political reasons to get rid of the current administration in the United States. If there's a bad economy, the chances are that uh, President Biden and Democratic, the Democratic Party would lose in the next election. As I said, if there's a big economic trouble and if they have a fake threat or even a real threat of war or if the war some conflict does happen wow that's going to worry people so badly and they will pull their money out of the stock markets because it will cause economic trouble you know paying for a war and uh, you don't know um, what resources and uh, machinery will be needed to build um, basically fighting machines, whatever they might be this time. And um, so like factories could actually be shut down as in past wars, uh, the big world wars, cars and even different food. You know, they, they stopped production of cars and uh, food was rationed. And, and so there's a big disruption in probably profits and definitely a big disruption in companies. So it's a big issue, very big issue, which because the markets are so extremely high right now, uh, historically overvalued at 250% approximately of their reasonable value, according to the CAPE ratio or the Buffett indicator, you should do, should do your own research about that but anyway so it put, puts the stock market at risk now we have positive things happening which is um, there are very high cases of COVID um, the pandemic continues but they are developing newer vaccines to take care of the new uh, variants and so that's going to knock back down the infection rate and also some new variants seem not to be as dangerous as the older ones but they're easier to get so there's a chance in the next three to six months that you know largely infections will be just down extremely down and so people are not going to be so worried they won't be sick and they will be going back to work and so the economy could do well because of excitement over electrification, um, possibly Russia removes its troops from the Ukrainian area near the border of Ukraine. And uh, so things could calm down. They really could. And people could get excited. And so, as I said, this is a positive thing. And um, so, in that case, we might not have a market crash or uh, we may have already gone through one. And uh, so then it would be a wonderful time to begin investing. And you should invest regularly over time just as a regular thing. If you're a worker uh, and you're younger 
If you're already retired, this pr video is probably not useful for you, but for an investor. Um, if you need the money uh, in the next five years, it's probably not a good idea to be investing in stock markets. You should do something else with the money, something very stable. As I said, probably get an investment advisor and uh, everybody could really benefit from investment advisors especially business owners you know they're busy 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 a lot of people are just too busy and they don't have the expertise and so you can gain it if you have plenty of free time and you're intelligent you're good at learning you can do that but as i said most people average person maybe nine out of ten people shouldn't be losing money and playing around, basically gambling, except for with a very small amount. But it's it's a risk, actually, that people can get addicted. So if you're if you are addicted to any substance at all, you should probably avoid this or any kind of gambling. Then don't don't get started. Just have somebody do it for you. And if you don't know. And you're not, as I said, if you're not an A student with very high grades and high intelligence and like strong willpower, then have somebody handle this for you. That would be much better, much better. Now, um, Lucid, so for you smart investors, there's a company called Lucid Motors and uh, it could be a good investment because especially if uh, stock prices come way down with some kind of crash or uh, a bear market over the next day to a couple of years. Things could get back to a reasonable value in the stock market with uh, maybe 100% or below reasonable historical value. And uh, just keep a watch out for Lucid and the CAPE ratio, C-A-P-E. But I'm mentioning Lucid because they have an incredible vehicle. They're new out on the market and there's somewhat of a mystery, which is how are their cars performing? There's almost no information of people driving them and making videos. And these cars are very expensive. So wealthy people just might not want to make videos. They could be older because most people who are wealthy uh, most uh, the wealth older people are richer than younger people in general you know they've done their inheritance and from the past uh you know their parents and their family that have passed away so they have that money or, or property or whatever and so they've they've got the money and they just might not want to make videos so that's maybe why we have not seen or i haven't seen a single lucid air dream edition or lucid vehicle youtube video by somebody who just bought the, bought the car i haven't seen one so it's a big mystery about you know are they fully functioning and we knew we know there was some issue about some uh, some vehicles not having all the software working and possibly some kind of trim piece that due to the pandemic it might not have been available and the software problems could could be caused by a similar issue and uh, so it's very confusing about what's happening and people are wondering did they are they somewhat scamming people about having manufactured complete vehicles and uh, some people are saying actually for years that lucid is a scam and they're a, you know they're a fraud and that they're not honest and so it's still somewhat of a mystery so you got to wait if you know please comment thumbs up if you like these topics and i can do more videos about more news so still looking for electric vehicles i don't don't see the electric vehicles out here 
maybe you did there might be a nissan leaf out here so anyway thank you very much for watching and have a great time check out the other videos by clicking on the excellent universe because i give advice that you need to hear not that you want to hear and it's going to help everybody so thank you very much goodbye